Good day, friends, and welcome to Pass It On, a high school talk show. Here on the show, we will speak to the people who ultimately will speak with you to share their insights and ideas to what they feel will help our students, staff, and or community members to surround our community. I'm your host, Andre Quattlebaum, also known as Coach Q. Uh, today, we're going to have an episode where we're going to talk about wellness prevention uh, methods. Um, so our school got together and they brought in some outside community members along with some staff members and we had a great old time. I, along with my correspondents, went around and we just spoke to a few people and talked about the things that what they think are helping for mental health uh, preparation, uh, de-stressors, any other type of activity. So, check it out. Hooray! Uh, good afternoon and welcome to Pass It On. I'm Coach Q. I'm here with Abby Burke. Hi, hey, Abby. Uh, we seem to have a great thing going on right now. Um, what made you come up with this idea? So, How did this idea come about? My friend Bella Allen, the other student who's been working on wellness, she went to a walk for the American Foundation for Suicide Prevention, and we thought that this would be a good idea for something to bring to our school. It started as an idea for an assembly, then we brought it to Mrs. Davenport, and we said, let's make it bigger, and here we are. Okay. So, um, how do you cope with stress? Um, I actually took yoga here in the fall, and I've used some of those uh, mindfulness and meditation. Yes, definitely. Um, and definitely just talking to people about my stress and making sure that I don't like build it all up and wait for it to explode. Okay. Um, what is it that you guys really want to get out of today? Um, the kids' experience, the teacher experience. What was it that you guys really want to identify in this? We wanted to break the stigma around mental health, and our goal is just to have at least one student walk away knowing that they have somewhere to turn if they are facing a mental health challenge and they need someone else. Okay. Yeah. Uh, there's one thing that you can leave and look into the camera and tell one thing about this particular aspect of what you think is going to be about. The aspect yeah. of this whole aspect. Okay, not to be okay, also. You heard it, Abby said it. Thank you, Abby. Appreciate it. Thank you. I'm Jada with Pass It On. Today I'm here with. Oh, Miss Davenport. Okay, so I'm going to ask you some questions about the like bonus. Okay, so, so what do you think causes the most stress in high school? Well, I think that you guys are not professional. I think that you're stressed out by your schoolwork, you get stressed out by social media, you get stressed out trying to fit in. Um, I think there's a lot of stress in high school. Okay, and how do you think students should like cope with their stress? Well, I hope that they're finding healthy ways to cope with stress. I fear that they do some unhealthy things, but um, that was the point of today, was to try to make sure that everybody got a couple of strategies to help de stress a little bit so that they can be the best, them, their best selves. That's their best selves, yes. What are you hoping that students will get out of wellness? Well, at first, I want kids to understand that. Um, that mental health is something that we can talk about and that they're not alone if they're struggling with stress. And I also want kids to walk away with some strategies that they can use to help them to make themselves feel better that are healthy. And then our your last question is, how does, like, do you think students like the stress that happen in school affect their relationships? Absolutely. I think that when kids are stressed, um, their grades go down. I think they are more agitated. I think that they tend to get into more fights. And then I think they fight with their parents. Nobody wants to do that. Thank you for your time. Thank you. What do you think causes the most stress in high school? Probably the amount of work we have and the expectations that we have these days. Okay, and the second question is, how do you cope with stress? I'm a lot of different ways. I guess talking to people that you trust, counselors, parents, and asking for their advice on okay. the
Mesker, and he's doing what? Sports trivia. Sports trivia. Okay, Mr. Mesker, I'm going to pass it on. What do you think causes the most stress for high school students? Uh, homework, classwork, assessments, me, uh, <laughs> everything. They're jobs, family life, sports. Okay. They've just got a lot going on. How do you cope with stress? I don't know. Uh, I, just, I like to sit in my basement and watch a movie. Okay. Um, do you believe that school stress affects the home life? Oh, of course. Uh, it affects everything in life. It affects your grades. It affects how you play. It affects your relationships. It affects everything. Okay. Well, he said it, and you've heard it. Thank you very much. Thank you. It's only because they Robin, 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 Robin,